Is it time to buy or sell Enphase stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Enphase. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, August 30, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since August 30, 2023, our system has ranked Enphase as a hold slash accumulate, giving it a score of 0.00. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock has had natural fluctuations, but currently sits at a loss of 0% since our initial hold slash accumulate recommendation. A score of 0 indicates that our system anticipates high volatility and risk for the following trading day. Given the latest developments, we are unable to determine the stock's next direction, as it could go either way. The stock lies in the middle of a very wide and falling trend in the short term and further fall within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend suggests a potential minus 26.86% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 32.28% and minus 8.74%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 47.34% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 50.91% and minus 16.40%. This translates to a price range of $62.89 to $107.10 after a year. Our latest daily update for Enphase includes the headline, Stronger Technical Forecast for Enphase Stock Price After Wednesday Trading. The Enphase stock price gained 2.24% on the last trading day, Wednesday, August 30, 2023, rising from $125.30 to $128.11. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 2.58% from a day low at $127.02 to a day high of $130.30. The price has fallen in 5 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 3.59% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day along with the price, which is a positive technical sign, and, in total, 2 million more shares were traded than the day before. In total, 2 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $227.37 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $339.92, and the lowest price was $120.90. Currently, the price is 62.31%, or $211.81, below the 52-week high of $339.92, which is also the all-time high for stock. Analyst Ratings On Thursday, August 17, 2023, it was reported that KeyBank gave ENPH a overweight grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, July 19, 2023, it was reported that Raymond James gave ENPH a overweight grade with a hold action. On Friday, June 30, 2023, it was reported that Citigroup gave ENPH a buy grade with a initialize action. On Monday, April 17, 2023, it was reported that BMO Capital gave ENPH a market perform grade with a initialize action. On Wednesday, March 22, 2023, it was reported that Susquehanna gave ENPH a positive grade with a upgrade action. Analysts have given Enphase stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for Enphase. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Thursday, August 24, 2023, and so far it has risen 4.72%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the 3-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. 
volume is rising along with the price. This is considered to be a good technical signal. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Enphase stock holds a buy signal from the short-term moving average. At the same time, however, the long-term average holds a general sell signal. Since the long-term average is above the short-term average there is a general sell signal in the stock giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the long-term moving average at $148.89. On a fall, the stock will find some support from the short-term average at $126.26. A breakup through the long-term average will give another buy signal, while a fall below the short-term average will add another sell signal and strengthen the general signal. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, by signal 5 days ago. Bollinger, by signal not applicable days ago. Short term moving average, by signal 2 days ago. Long term moving average, sell signal 27 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 25 days ago. If we look at the 12 month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 27 days ago. The long-term moving average, by signal 34 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 163 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Enphase Enphase finds support from accumulated volume at $125.30 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $3.28 between high and low, or 2.58%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 3.14%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Enphase, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per-share earnings. This extremely high P-E ratio suggests that the stock could be overvalued. However, it's not uncommon for tech companies or those with huge market potential to have such high ratios. In other news, the next earnings report for Q3 2023 is expected on October 23, 2023. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $1.10. Keep an eye on these numbers, as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Enphase. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Enphase is at $135.45. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Enphase encounters its first support level at $125.30. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Enphase from multiple analyst sources is strong buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On July 28, 2023, Rogers Thurman J conducted an insider buy of 900,090 shares of common stock. On July 28, 2023, Rogers Thurman J conducted an insider sell of 5 million shares of 4% convertible senior notes due 2023. On July 21, 2023, Ranhoff David A. conducted an insider buy of 13,200 shares of common stock. On July 21, 2023, Ranhoff David A. conducted an insider buy of 30,000 shares of common stock. On July 7, 2023, Rogers Thurman J. conducted an insider buy of 2,475 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of minus 53.680. Overall, 
Insiders purchased 1,727,750 shares and sold 5,917,792 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $122, minus 4.77%. This stock has medium daily movements and this gives medium risk. There is a buy signal from a pivot bottom found 4 days ago. Is Enphase stock a good buy? Enphase holds several positive signals, but we still don't find these to be enough for a buy candidate. At the current level, it should be considered as a hold candidate, hold or accumulate, in this position whilst awaiting further development. We have upgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a sell to a hold slash accumulate candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Thursday, August 31st, we expect Enphase to open up $0.367 and start trading at $128.48. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.